out there and you've had issues with, uh, and I'm speaking from my social worker background, if you've had issues with filing for Medi-Cal insurance, uh, Section 8 housing, uh, any other type of the aid programs, cash aid, welfare, WIC, all that type of stuff, that is 100% connected to the census and to the count itself. So if you have those counts into the local county, uh, then that money has to be allocated into those exact resources that we have in programs to directly help our communities. So uh, not having those numbers or whatever, that money is then deviated from our community and definitely goes to the next community over. So the importance of the count alone, again, where the, you know, where the uh, numbers are, it's exactly where the money flows. Yeah, so my perspective in terms of um, the African-American community not being counted um, directly affects what services are available. It directly affects what type of services that are available. You know, when you look at um, every county receives millions of dollars for funding for mental health services, and the counties are able to utilize that funding based on how their stakeholders say they should use that funding. But when we're not counted in the census and we don't participate in stakeholder meetings, then we don't have a say in what type of services, uh, mental health services or substance use services we're going to have access um, to in our communities. And so you don't really see a lot of services that are specific for the African-American community, although there's a lot of interventions and programs available, but you don't see them in our counties. And so for me, that is a direct correlation of not being counted. And so then in some ways it looks like we don't really need services. There isn't a need, but we know that that's not true. Roughly as it stands with the census numbers, there's only about 9,000, a little over 9,000 uh, counted or census registered African-Americans or blacks in Tulare County. But you and I know that for those of us who live here, uh, you definitely see more people than that. You walk around the cities, you go to the, some of the events, some of the churches and things like that. And you can start to guess and count that we probably have way more uh, African-American blacks in our community here in Tulare County, but we definitely need to get them on the books. We got to count because your count equals that money. And as brother Greg said, we want our $20,000. But it's, it reminds me of a story of a city that had a rock blocking, a stone blocking the highway to where people could, couldn't get food or nothing. And all the smart people and the people of the city went down to help move the stone. But the stone wasn't moved. And the reason why the stone wasn't moved is that they were all working their own way. When they finally learned to come on one side together, they pushed the rock away. Get on the right side and push what you got. We can do it. God's on awesome. our side.